For his first feature film, West of Sunshine, Australian director Jason Raftopoulos has expanded his award-winning short film, Father's Day. The premise is simple enough. On a summer's day in Melbourne, Jim, Damien Hill, a chronic gambler eking out a precarious living as a courier, has to raise the $15,000 he desperately needs to repay his increasingly threatening former boss, Banos, Tony Nikotopoulos, and at the same time, take care of his prepubescent son, Alex, Ty Parham, when his angry estranged wife, Karen, Faye Smythe, insists that he fulfil his parental duties during school holidays. Seemingly influenced by Vittorio De Sica's neorealist classic, Bicycle Thieves, this story of a loser incapable of saving himself from his own addiction is uneven, but somehow manages to overcome the frustrations inherent in the character of Jim, thanks to a convincing performance from Damien Hill. You all right? Yeah. Doesn't look it. Why didn't you come last week? I told you, I had something on. I couldn't get out of it. But you promised. I know. I'm sorry, okay? Now, what's going on? Young Perham, Hill's real-life stepson, also impresses as the kid for whom a day with his dad, despite the tensions and the difficulties, will always be remembered. Non-professional actors in minor roles are well used, and though Tom Neal's photography is at times needlessly jittery, the film offers a convincing visualisation of an urban jungle where its misguided protagonist is constantly making the wrong decisions. I'm giving West of Sunshine three stars. Thank you.